Oh, you have kids? You already had me wait an hour and a half. So it's for my kids. We have kids? Yeah, you owe me that. And they were their daddy? <laughs> no, that's not working. No, that is. Oh my God, so. That's so Go ahead and bring another steak and some uh, potatoes. Okay. No, nah, yeah. I'm not bringing no potatoes. Another, potatoes. Um, uh, sesame I'm not bringing a check. I'm paying, for, I'm paying for my meal. And your meal. I'm not paying and for your kids, kids meal. meal. No. Yes, you are. No, I'm not paying for oh their kids God. meal. No, no. So you don't think you owe me after having me wait an hour and a half? I told you I owe you. I owe you one. I take you out. Okay, again. And so you're gonna pay for my Ah, ladies and gentlemen, anybody want to tell me just what in the don't stress, I know how the finesse is going on here. This lady gonna sit here with a straight face and say this man owe her to, to he owes her food for her children because he was late to the date look here um y'all just come up with all kind of stuff in y'all head let me hit you with the headline if you're broke just say that yeah yes yes and, and don't be getting at me that how you know she broke because she sat there and waited on that man an hour and a half that man was an hour and a half late for his date Ain't no woman with money in her pocket gonna wait on anybody for an hour and a half for nothing. If a woman talk to a man and y'all say, I'm getting ready to go on this date. Look, the fact that you were late an hour and a half, I know of if you a grown woman, and you 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 got your business to get like you say. I'm talking about you grown. If you drove there, if y'all were meeting there, you drove yourself to that date. You got dressed, took your time, got your hair done, nails done. You wash your face. You wash up under your arm twice before you got. You got your own car, your own place. And you can handle your own business. Ain't no way in the hell you waiting an hour and a half for no man. You ain't waiting an hour and a half for nobody. You understand what I'm saying? Grown woman. And then she had nerves say, and you took me to Red Lobster. Like, oh, what the? Like, oh, like, okay, so Red Lobster ain't good enough for nobody no more. Is that what that is? Red Lobster ain't good enough for nobody no more. If you don't like Red Lobster, fine. But my thing is, you sat your behind in Red Lobster for an hour and a half waiting on somebody to show up so they can feed you. And now all of a sudden, it, it, ain't, it, it ain't all of that. If the Red Lobster wasn't all of that, it wouldn't have been all of that when somebody suggested it. Red Lobster, just fine. I'm sick and tired of y'all got here in the world trying to act like everything too good. Ugh. So you just going to take me over here? I, I mean, ugh, this I, girl, you first of all, I met you at Mickey D's. Huh? Counting change. At the counter counting change. That, that's, where, that's where I caught you. So don't sit up here and try to act like, act like Red Lobster. You know what I'm saying? You ain't had a cheddar biscuit in four years. Don't sit up here to act. I know better. Don't don't do that. Don't do that. So y'all 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 need to get y'all y'all need to get y'all self together. This this girl gonna sit up here and tell me I like let's review this whole thing. You met this guy. Y'all said y'all were getting ready to go on a date. You sat here and waited in Red Lobster, which is not good enough for you. You waited here for an hour and a half for him to show up. You sat there and you ate and everything. Then when it come time to go, you want to turn around and tell this man, oh, well, you need to order some food for my kids so I can bring back my kids. You owe me that because you was late. No, you was trying to figure out from the beginning. That, that, this what you do, ma'am. You go out on dates with guys. You, you try to spend their money trying to, to handle this business. That's your responsibility. Them your kids. That's your damn responsibility, and they follow to make sure them kids fed. You don't know that damn man. You don't know him. Y'all don't care nothing about y'all y'all reputation out here in the world. If people, you don't know who know who and what somebody will say about what. Stop trying to swindle and swipe and finesse people out of stuff. You, your whole intention, you went on that date so your ass could eat. That's why you sat there and waited an hour and a half, because you're hungry. And them cheering hungry. And, and and him being late was the perfect excuse for you to use to say, well, you owe me this, so you need to buy my kids some food. You know good and hell well. That's a week behind excuse, and you're trying to finesse. Stop playing. 
Stop playing. Now him he now now this this thing about both of y'all ain't ain't hit no much. Because as a man, if you know you're gonna be that damn late, just say, listen, we got to reschedule. You don't have no woman waiting no damn hour and a half for no date. And ain't no woman who bout something gonna sit there and wait no damn hour and a half. If she got kids and she got things to do, she gonna say, Hey, look, maybe we need to reschedule. After after it hit the twenty minute mark, look here, I I got something to do. I got somewhere to be. Right, cause we ain't got to go in there, but you, you didn't leave cause your ass was hungry. And I'm willing to bet that you didn't drive. So to the man, you need to get your stuff together cause you, you're too grown out here not to be on time. You understand what I'm saying? Too grown. You got to be on time. And young lady, find another way for you to feed your damn kids. Them your children, your responsibility. You understand what I'm saying? You, you, you lay, you got, you, you lay, you play. And now you got to pay. I don't know what they. It ain't everybody else's fault. Get it together. Y'all better get it together. Out here embarrassing the whole community. That's why we can't get nowhere.